The cooker containers are delivered in a pack stack and the stack height can vary in order to optimize the freight for delivery. The rigid covers can be found at the top of each stack and each one comes with zip ties in order to seal the liners of each cougar. Each cougar comes with its own lip palette and the palettes come in two different sizes, either 48 by 48 inch or 45 by 45 inch. Use a utility knife to unwrap the pack stack so that you can begin to set up the cougars. Next, take the rigid covers and set them off to the side. Stand the flattened cougar on the lip palette and use a utility knife to cut open the strapping that is used to hold it closed. Remove the spin top cover to break the liner seal so that the cougars can be opened. Once the liner has been opened, two handlers can gently pry the cougar open so that it will stand independently on its palette. For quicker setup, a blower can also be used which will quickly inflate the container. Make sure that the Pack Gen logo and the open side of the pallet are the same direction. It is very important to never cut the SureFit strap that is located at the top perimeter of each Cougar container. The lifting straps are tied off on each side of the container and shouldn't be cut loose unless needed to reposition on the pallet. When ready to fill the containers, purge them with dry ice or nitrogen and fill according to your loading procedures. It's important to fill the cougars to a minimum of 90% of its capacity. This shows how the SureFit straps prevents the side walls from bulging. To seal the liners on an open top linered cougar, grab each liner independently and twist it and zip it shut. There are three steps involved with sealing the cougars with a utility transfer chute. First, gather and twist the inner liner and then zip it shut with a zip tie. Then push the liner inside the spin ring and attach the spin top cover tightly. Push the inner liner that has been sealed twice down into the outer liner and then gather and twist the outer liner and then seal it with the zip tie. Place the rigid cover on the top of the cougar and then with the strapping provided, tie a square knot at each corner. As a reminder, a square knot is right over left and then left over right. Standard paint pens can be used to label and mark the cougar. Spray adhesive helps to adhere the hazardous waste shipping labels. When staging the full cougars out in the field, make sure to leave ample space for visual inspection and labeling. <laughs>